What's up everyone, welcome back to another video and this video I'm going to talk about how to fix the scenes for what is having an issue with application not found on your Steam and how we can fix this up. So let me directly get into a step. So the first one is all about we just need to open a game. Now from here what we need to do is just go to the game by click and go to manage. Now from here click on browse local file. And from here, what we need to do is, we just need to navigate to the folder named the game. Now if we can navigate to bin folder. Now we can see this is the launcher. So select the launcher right click and go to show more options, properties. Now from here, what we need to do is just click on compatibility. Now we need to run this program in the compatibility mode. That is what we have to try as the first one. Now click on run this program as an administrator. Now from here, what we need to do is just go to apply and go for OK. This is what we have to do as the first and foremost step. Make sure we need to close this, go to the game once again, right click and go to properties, installer file and verify the gritty of game file. So this is going to take a little bit of time. So what happens is it will be cross checking every single file of a game. And if any files are there and if any kind of issues are there, that is going to fix by it. So which is going to take a lot of time. So what I'm going to do is let me skip this particular step. This will take time, so just make sure that you have to wait for this completely done, patiently have to wait for it. Next one is all about even after trying with the stay if you're having the trouble. Just go over here, over here, right click and go to the properties. Now from here, we need to navigate to browse. Now from here, navigate to the folder named installer. Now from here, we have to get into the folder named origin. Go to register folder, go to internal. Now we have EA app installer. So right click on this one, go to run as administrator and it might ask you some kind of in your pop-up message like this, go for yes. Now the EA app will be popping up and you have an option to repair and just go for repair. So this particular step is going to take a lot of time. So what happens is the EA app will be completely repaired and the EA app will be opening up. Now, you know, the either of the issue can happen with the Steam or EA app. So to the users with the EA app, once after this particular process, they can directly open up the EA app. And if you wanted to continue playing the game with the EA app, you can search for it. So that is what we have to do. It won't take much time. Hardly, I have to say, maximum the entire process of EA app running and repair might take care of three minutes, but even though it worth a lot. So we need to wait for this. Once that, you can launch this thing and you'll not be having this trouble. So this is what you have to do. And I hope this quick video is helpful. And if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notification. That's it. Bye bye.